Alright guys, today we're doing the March Madness Losers Bracket. So, basically how this is going to work is all the teams that lost in round 1 of the first 32 teams first, yeah, of the first round. They lost, the like, what did the first day, days of the round First up is Purdue versus Texas A&M CC. So, Obviously, since Purdue is number one seed, they get the they get a ton of their names on this wheel so that they have the highest chance, and we're gonna. Whoops! All right, here we go. All right, who is gonna win this game? Purdue or Texas A&M CC, and it's gonna be Purdue. All right, so. Unsurprisingly, Purdue comes up victorious. Who is going to win this game? Going to be a close game. Very, and it looks like Oral Roberts. Oral Roberts, which is, we probably know the result of that game was going to be, but we're, we're, we haven't gotten to it yet. All right, so Western Virginia University versus Kennesaw State. So, since Kennesaw so. Kansas State's going to have one, and WVAU is going to have two. So, all right. We're going to see who the winner of this game will be. And it's going to be Western Virginia University. But Western Virginia University has moved on to see who they will play, GC or Illinois. We're going to probably see... Illinois, but we haven't found the result yet. Oh my goodness! GCU pulls off the upset there. So, wow. Surprising result there. So, GCU is going to play Western Virginia. I mean, West Virginia. Why do we keep saying Western Virginia? All right, Texas A&M versus Vermont. Vermont. Obviously, you know how it works. Teams very close to each other. Can win, can get, can play each other. And Vermont, both teams get upset. Both of these teams getting upset. So Vermont upsets Texas A and eight. Could still not win because I put Iona first. So we'll see what happens. Whatever the wheel likes. And but Utah State ex. Effectively wins that. So Utah State, the winner of that one. Goodbye to Iona. So Providence versus Kent State. This game's also a pretty close game. So Alright. So obviously you notice the higher seed gets two and the lower seed gets one. Who's gonna win? And it's gonna be Providence. So Providence had the higher chances of winning, and they did. So, Providence expectedly wins the game. UNC Asheville versus Iowa State. So, Iowa State's actually going to get three. UNC Asheville's only going to get one because Iowa is top ten. All right, well, it's not as close this anymore. Iowa is top five, so I'm making a new rule. If the top five team plays a team that's that's lower than 20, that's lower. That's twenty or lower. The the top five team gets gets three. So Iowa heavily favored in this one. If they can win, and they will, looks like it. Yes, Iowa is the winner. So, oh wait, it was Iowa State, sorry. Iowa State, though, very unexpectedly wins. So, Virginia versus Howard, another one that's top five versus 20 or lower. So, Virginia gets three, Howard only gets one. And we're going to see who will win the game. And, oh, but it could go to Howard. No, Virginia is the winner of the game. So, 
Virginia very, very expectedly wins the game. Virginia versus either Charleston or Arizona State. So this Arizona State gets two. We're going to see who is going to win. And Charles pulls the upset. Charleston upsets Arizona State. But it's fine for now. Okay, so the winter is gonna be USC. I mean, everyone expected that. All right, let's go. See who's gonna be the winner of this one. And Iowa, who had the fa who was favored to win, does and. Next up is Memphis versus Montana State. So Memphis is not top five. So still they're only going to get two for this one. And it looks like it's going to be Memphis. No Montana State upset that everyone wanted to see. Sorry, Montana State fans, if you are watching this, but you lost. Because you're the 27th, 26th seed in this Loser con consolidation tournament. So Memphis moves on to either play USCB or Boise State. So USCB versus Boise Boise State. So US winner. Oh wait, wait, wait. Boise State gets two. Okay, never mind. They won anyway. They were higher favored, so I'm not doing it so, anyway. Oh, oops. All right, it's fine. It's fine. Actually, it's fine. Uh, Boise State was highly have um. Favored higher, so it's fine. Uh, back to real. So, the winner of this game is gonna be VCU. Remove all the instances of VCU. All right, VCU won this game, but they're not. They weren't really. That expected to win. NC State could have easily won. All right, North Kentucky versus Arizona. The final round, the final game in the first round. Arizona, since they're top five versus a twenty or lower. Arizona gets three. Did I put Arizona on twice? Hold on. I better not put Arizona. Oh no no no! I'm thinking of um. I'm thinking of um, Virginia. All right. North Kentucky. Probably one of the worst teams in this bracket besides the, I don't know, the team that played Purdue. I think I messed up on the Purdue bracket, but Arizona obviously won. So, Arizona... All right, round two. Purdue versus Oral Roberts. <laughs> All right, so there's no match info. Um, Purdue, so they're not 20 or lower, so Purdue only gets two. Who's going to win this one? Maybe Oral Roberts pulls off the upset here. And no, Purdue won. All right, so we thought maybe Oral Roberts could pour, pull that off, but they didn't. Um, I put this right. Yeah. The winner. Oh, God, that sound made me uncomfortable. My toenail just scraped my chair. That's, that was terrible. All right. Well, West Virginia won. And... I mean, no one is no one surprised about that, really. Okay, so West Virginia versus Purdue. So a good game. I mean, well, kind of a good game, kind of a good game. Um, for the first game, the awful eight, and then next we got Vermont versus Utah State. So Vermont is gonna have the disadvantage here. Utah State. So I don't have to manually remove them. So Vermont, can they pull off the upsets? 
Maybe. No. Utah State is the winner. So. Utah. Seen some upsets so far. Providence didn't pull one off, but we're gonna see here. Can no. So Iowa State <laughs> one wins it. Very very unsurprising result there. Next up, so I town. <laughs> All right, who wins? This game, oh, it's gonna be Virginia. All right, Virginia, congrats on your win. And next up, first letter of every team. All right, Iowa or USC, who's gonna take this one home? It's gonna be USC with the upset. Good, all right, congrats to USC. Pulls up the upset. Gonna go playing against Virginia. So, Memphis versus Boise State. So, what? What? All right, I don't know what that just did. That was weird. Memphis versus Boise State. Boise State, can they pull off the upset? Uh, no. Memphis wins. Okay. Memphis, congrats on your win that everyone thought you would get. So, Memphis moves on to see VCU or Arizona. The final game in the sad 16 is what we're calling it because they lost. So, they're sad because they suck. Um... Um, all right, what do we have now? AZ versus VCU, who is gonna win? Gonna be Arizona, okay. Everyone knew Arizona was gonna win that one. Let's be honest. Everybody knew Arizona would win that game. So, all right, we're officially in the awful eight now. We're almost done with the consolidation brackets. We're almost to the fatal four. <laughs> um. All right, we're gonna make a twist for the last eight rounds. There's only one. Each team only gets one name on the wheel. Purdue versus Western Virginia University. Only get one to make upsets more possible. And that is why I did that. Because Purdue, you lost in the first round. You really don't deserve any glory because you literally were the number one seed and you lost. So goodbye, Purdue. Rest in peace, my friend. Because WVAU, Western Virginia, I mean West Virginia University, moves on to the Fatal Four. All right, guys. Utah State versus Iowa State. Again, one I state versus U state. Okay, who is gonna win this one? Iowa State, the actually expected to win, wins. So, removed it, removed it. Congrats, Iowa State. Oh, the only game that we bring back the advantages. So, all right, VA versus USC, who will take a trip to the Fatal Four? No! All right, we still have West Virginia, never mind. All right, you, I mean, West Virginia is not in Virginia, but it's fine. It's close. USC pulls off the upset against the three-seed Virginia. So great job there. Memphis versus Arizona. Okay, good game here. AZ versus Memphis. Memphis. This okay, Memphis versus AZ. Ooh. Oh, all right. Arizona was expected to win that game, and guess what? They did. So now the fatal four has begun. 
Western Virginia. I mean, West Virginia. Why do I keep saying Western Virginia? I'm sorry, West Virginia fans. West Virginia versus Iowa State, okay? Who will win? Western Virginia. No, West Virginia wins and takes a trip to the terrible two. Uh, he who will go to the the terrible two? USC first West Virginia the terrible two game, and this is gonna be an insane game. So. Don't ask me why we need one, but we will. The score generator, though. Per Wait, actually, no. This is not going to be a score generator. This is going to see how many names each gets. So, first, we're spinning for USC to see how many names they get on it. So, USC. Look, we got one, two, three, four, five. All right, how many names does USC get on this wheel? USC only gets one name. So USC, very low advantage here. But hoping you gets one name too. So it will be even. All right. No way, no shot that just happened. Okay, wow, 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 wow. So West Virginia gets one name on it too. So the championship game, who will take it all? Who will be the worst one? USC versus West Virginia. Who takes it all? USC wins it all. USC is the champion of it all. Congratulations, USC. You have gone really far and won the entire championship. You're the worst one. So, you guys, if you want me to do this with the Sweet 16, Elite 8, or Final 4, which the final four consolidation bracket. That would actually be the shortest thing ever. I will do it. So, if you want me to do it with the Sweet 16, like the video. And, I, and if this video gets a certain amount of likes, I'll do it. But I won't do it on this channel. I'll have another channel for that. And it will be called CDM Sports. Okay, maybe not. I don't know. I don't even know if I'll get another channel, okay? But I'm saying that because I probably should. <laughs>